is the SEC championship game, and the fans have packed the stadium ready for an intense matchup. Today's game will be played in a controlled climate of a dome. So let's get set for the LSU Tigers and the Gamecocks of South Carolina. And here come the Gamecocks. Hello and welcome to this battle for the SEC Championship. I'm Brad Nessler, your play-by-play -play man, and in the booth with me as always, two of the best. Lee Corso and Kirk Herbstreit. Kirk, how do you see this one? This really looks like a deadlock. This could go to either team. Well, in a close matchup like this, I always like to look at the individual. South Carolina has been a little suspect at times this year against the run, and the challenge for them will be to slow down this running attack and this running back. And I'm going to tell you something. I don't think they have the personnel to do it. Let me tell you what I think about this football game. South Carolina feels that they have an advantage in the passing game, and I agree with them. I don't see this defense matching up well against these receivers at all. Close game, but they pull it out. Thank you, guys. The team captains are on the field, and this game is about to get underway. And they're ready to kick this one away. Decent kick. Looks to be returnable. Number 15 takes it at the 8. He's hit and got away. A little zoo. Shakes off a tackle. And he's tackled. And the quarter. The shotgun. He drops back. Throws this one out to the left. Finds his receiver. The 50. Brought down. And he hauled that one in for a first down. Well, that's a big-time play. Did an excellent job there of getting separation from the defender, and he's able to pull down that pass for quite a few yards. They'll throw on first down. He's going left. The ball is tipped. On the ground with the tailback. They'll drop in for a loss. Back to the line of scrimmage, and that's it. Across the middle. Got him again. He ignores the footsteps and makes the catch. He appears to have been injured on the play. They hand it off. And they make the stop. The fullback gains him. Drops back to pass. That's a throw. Couldn't haul it in. The wideout unable to catch that pass. Back to pass. Across the middle. Got his man. So they call it tight end's number, and he comes through with the score. He did a great job here of using his size to create space for himself so the quarterback can kick the ball into him without any defenders getting in the way. But you know, in high school, this guy was so big, he played defensive tackle. They'll throw on first down. He's looking. He's scrambling. Looks like he's going to run. And he got about six on that. Number 25 is a deep back as they line up in the eye. On the ground with the tailback. Sheds that one. They'll bring him down. They'll get two on. And they tackle well. That combination means one thing for the offense. They, they've been playing great football. He drops back. Across the middle. And that one's fallen incomplete. And they're going to get somebody for interference on that play. Let's see who the call is on. Pass interference on the defense. Spot foul. First down. They call him for. It's a direct snap. And down he goes. That's a 10-yard gain. Keep it on the ground with the tailback. And he's taken down. And the short. On the ground with the tailback. Can't wrap him up. Touchdown, South Carolina. Boy, this kid knows how to run with the football, doesn't he? I think everybody knew it. In fact, the defensive coordinator told me last night he didn't want this guy to be. Well, it's going to take more than X's and O's to stop this guy. they got to tackle him. And they'll be returning this one. Number five fields it at the seven. He jukes him. Spin move. The offense heads number 25. Lines up in the deep back. Eye formation. With the spin. Brought down. The running back gets two on the carry. 
The Gamecocks bring in the nickel package. They snap it to the back. He spins around, and he's taken down. That'll be a pickup of... Number 12 lines up in the shotgun. Drops back to pass. Rolling out to the right side. And now he's going to improvise. Slides down. What an outstanding play is yet to go. But at the end of one, our score, South Carolina, 14. LSU, not the Tiger. Go with the eye formation. Under pressure. Looking. He's going to try and scramble. Look out. That is ball. Fantastic play by the gear. Set up in the gun. Bad snap from center. Can't find anyone open. He decides to run with it. And they make the stop. They hand it off again. Brought down. That's a seven-yard gain. Back to pass. Looks. He's rolling right. He's in trouble. Now he's scrambling. And now he's going to run. They'll bring him down. He decides. LSU comes to the line with three wide. He lets it go. And he came down with it. What a catch. They hooked up for the big play. The coaches do a good job of getting this receiver the ball. They designed plays specifically for him, like the one we just saw. And the end results are huge chunks of yardage and touchdowns. They snap it to the back. Here he goes. And he's tackled. About eight yards there. Pitch left. And they got him for a loss. That toss had no room to work as the defense. He drops back. He's going left. The ball is tipped. So the, the Tigers come out showing three wide. Here's the option. He lateral. He tries to spin. And down he goes. Drops back to pass. Pressure coming. He scrambled. And now he's got room to run. And he turned that one into a nice game. Brad, this is who lines up in a shotgun set. They snap it to the back. Broke away from one. There's a fumble. Scoops up the loose ball. Fumbles the ball. Number 71 with a recovery. They nearly gave that ball. Number 12 comes to the line with three wide. Back to pass. He's looking. Batted ball. The big guy picked it off. What a play. The defensive lineman came down with it. Boy, there's something you don't see every day. A big old defensive. And they hit him in the backfield. Absolutely no blocking up front. Hey, sometimes a... LSU lines up with five defensive backs. Wants to throw outside. Batted ball. That'll bring up fourth down. Fourth down. Going with the shotgun here. He drops back. Looking. Throws this one out to the left. Heads up play to bat it down. They go with the option. And now he pitches it. And he puts it on the turf. Defense says they've got it. And they do. The Tigers bring in their dime package. Throws it to the outside. Onto his lap. South Carolina going with the wishbone here. He spins, breaks one, and they make the stop. He carries the ball for three. Drops back to pass. Wants to throw outside, and it's knocked away. Number 12 lines up in the shotgun. Looks, short toss. Batted ball. Guys, someone with 23-yard line. Number 12 with three wide receivers. He's looking. He steps up. It's tipped. Tipped away. South Carolina comes out defensively with six defensive backs. Here comes the pressure. Looks like he's going to run. Fumble! Using those good hands, he scoops up the fumble. Nice play fake. Looking. Scrambling around. He's under some heat. He takes off. He's knocked out of bounds. Must not have put six defensive backs. Hits the ball. No, they faked it. Wants to throw outside. Got it to his receiver. Well, that completion there gives him. The Tigers set up in the gun. Looks across the middle. Got him again. And he's tackled. They pick up solid yardage there. Yeah. They'll work from the shotgun. He drops back. Steps up. Fires a bullet out to the right. Hauls it in for the touchdown. He grabbed that one for his second touchdown of the half. And that second touchdown pass was just as pretty as the first one. This guy's good. First half of play. Our halftime score, South Carolina, 17. LSU, 14. And the teams are lined up to start the second half. And they'll be returning this one. Number five takes it at the four. 
Time once again for this off. Tiger line up in an eye formation up the middle. And they make the stop. Picked up a yard of anything on that run. Drops back to pass. He's going right. Got him. At the point. And he's tackled. What do you think of that one, Mr. Corso? Well, I'm going to say that was a nice. Lines up in a dime defense here. They snap it to the back. Oh, what a move. And down he goes. That's a 10-yard gain. And he's taken down. The running line up with six defensive backs. Looking. Across the middle. And it's caught. And they make the stop. And a pickup of about seven. Bring in their dime package. They snap it to the back. He's into the open field. And down he goes. And it looks like he got the first down. Look at this drive. One man backfield. They'll throw on first down. Looks. He's scrambling. Under pressure. Throws it to the outside. It's tipped. In and out. They come out with four wide outs. He drops back. He's looking. Across the middle. He's got it. Brought down. Wow. How about that third down conversion? Boy, what a... They find themselves in the red zone for the first time today. He's on the run. And down he goes. How did they get there? South Carolina comes out defensively with six defensive backs. He's looking down the middle. And he dropped it. Almost a nice catch. This is they keep it on the ground with the tailback. And he's taken. Drops back to pass. Throws this one out to the left. And now he's got room to run at the point. Inside the 30 to the 10. And they tackle him. Your reaction to that pass? Counter right. Bounces off the would-be tackler. Tackle. Back to the line of scrimmage, and that's it. LSU comes out with two tight ends. They'll run the option. Pitches back. There he goes. Spin move. A five-yard gain. He drops back. Looking. Rolls to the right. Throws this one out to the right. Caught. The 50. And he line up in the shotgun. Back to pass. Looks. Rolling out to the left side. He's going to try and scramble. And they get the sack. Bless you. In a four-wide set, he's looking. Going deep, and he's got a man. Off his hands, incomplete. On the ground with the tailback. And down he goes. And they threw a flag on that play. Let's see what the call is. Throws this one out to the right. Number 31 picks it off. Why would you make a pass like that when you've got the lead? It's simple. You don't. That was not a good choice by the quarterback. It sure wasn't. Call another play. Dump the ball short. Call a draw play. Run a sweep. Something. But don't put the ball in the air where the defense can make a play. They'll throw on first down. Looking. He's in trouble. Got hit as he threw. The D Carolina lines up with five defensive backs. They go with the option. And he's tackled. Four yards there on the old Pesu. Comes out in the shotgun. It's a direct snap with the spin. Brought down. They attempted to pick. They have to try to convert here. Can't find anyone open. Under heavy pressure. And down he goes. They went for it, but they... Drops back to pass. With the throw. And it's... He drops back. Throws this one out to the right. It's dropped. South Carolina lines up in a shotgun set. Wants the middle. And down he goes. On third and long. <laughs> Setting up the play action. Throws it to the outside. And he can't hang up. On the ground with the tailback. And he's tackled. LSU. They'll bring in their dime package. Back to pass. He scrambled. Wants to throw outside. And he's all the way down to the 40s. The game cut. Bring in the nickel package. He unloads it. Complete. They'll drop him for a loss. The game comes. Line up in a nickel back. Looks. Here they come. Across the middle. The quarterback's got it. Bring in the nickel package. Drop back to pass. He's looking. Scrambling around. He's got all day. Throws this one out to the left. The ball is tipped. Coach, you made a nice. Here we go. He's on the run. He's got to throw it in a hurry. No one open. He's going to run. Brought down. And they get a first down. What's well, a up and down field, and the quarterback makes a great decision to take off with it and convert on fourth down. Spins up field, loses the football, and the defense is on it. And that fumble is going to cost him. Now, at this stage in the game, the number one rule has to be to hold on to the football. Another wide.
wide open year in the SEC, and it was concluded here in this conference championship. Your take on the game, guys. I'd like to be the first to congratulate both teams for the way they represented the SEC with some great football. But my hat goes off to our champs and how they showed once again why they won't be denied when they see something they want. And in this case, it was the SEC championship. That concludes another game of NCAA Football 2005. Our final score, South Carolina 20, LSU 14. So for Lee Corso and Kirk Herbstreet, this is Brad Nessler.